What's up? Today we will be creating theories on how to beat triplets. So let's see what we need to do to beat them with the lowest level equipment possible. First we will need Korblox Horn, Titan Shield, Starvation and Jade, not necessary just for invincibility frames, and rulers or Omega armor. Now, we need a ranged weapon, the event weapons or a normal one will help as long as it does a lot of damage, I would recommend Fire Potion plus Omega or Nature plus Fire. Both of these weapons are very good, plus with the Fire Potion they can really do 100k DPS. Now let's get to the strategy I formulated. So when triplets spawn in, you want to use as much Titan Shield plus Starvation summons as possible. Titan Shield Raw is pretty much enough to tank at least one eye, but Starvation plus Titan Shield is enough to tank at least four. Don't ask how I got four from, but we will use these core block summons to stall. So let's get on to damaging the eyes, you would usually place two minions to tank everything. This solves the case of being not being safe. So we will need to damage the eyes, you cannot beat the ruby eye without beating the other two eyes. Emerald and Sapphire, so focus on the most dangerous one. So let's think for a second, it's simple really the most dangerous one is Sapphire, as it does the most damage and doesn't have much avoidable attacks. Defeating this eye will solve a lot of problems. Emerald is the least you want to worry about, as the Corblox minions will dodge the lasers. Very easy. So once we beat both of these eyes, we can unlock the ability to damage the ruby eye. This eye has the power of both eyes, and gets angry when you heal half its health to it. So be careful. What we want to do is spawn Titan Shields plus Starvation Minions, this will stall the eye. And this will be easy. And this is it for beating the triplets. Happy farming slash grinding everybody. And be sure to at least do this a total of 64 times, to get the equipment to make Muse Mask. See you guys later!